endless pain and destruction. The United Nations has raised the number of civilians killed in Ukraine to 7,110 and the number of wounded to more than 11,500 since the war began almost one year ago. Five people died in Russian bombardments on Sunday and Monday in cities including Kherson and Kharkiv. This brings the death toll to 170 since the beginning of 2023. Ukraine says it urgently needs weapons from the West in order to push Russian troops out of its territory and end the war. Its president, who today received a visit from the Danish Prime Minister in Mykolaiv, is calling for faster deliveries and for some taboos to be broken, such as the delivery of combat aircraft. Germany is still opposed, but other Western countries appear to be open to the idea. However, Russia says delivering more weapons to Ukraine would only provoke a, quote, significant escalation of the conflict. Moscow, meanwhile, is claiming territorial gains in Donetsk and Bakhmut, something Kyiv denies. Bakhmut has been suffering under the constant hammering of Russian artillery for months, but Ukrainian troops are holding their positions. And although the town is almost completely destroyed, there are glimpses of life in its streets.